Hey, yeah, check this out, man. Um, so we got the whole thing with Jamel Charlo and his fucking stupid ass Gatorade bottle that keep getting talked about. And a lot of people are accusing this man, and it all started with Tony Harrison. Um, Tony Harrison, man, I'm gonna tell you something right now, man. I like Tony Harrison, but this little stunt he pulled. Like I said before, was dishonorable, and he really not getting a rematch now. <laughs> if he thought he was getting a rematch, we ain't getting no rematch. The only way Tony Harrison can get a rematch is if he build himself back up. Um, he, he, you know what I'm saying? He was a world champion. I heard him on the boxing voice. That he said, "Why should he have to fight Tony Harrison?" I mean, Erickson Lubin, if he just fought, if he was just a world champion, you know what I'm saying, he just fought Jamel Charlo. Well, Jamel Charlo was a world champion, and Erickson Lubin got a shot with him, and he was just coming from being a prospect. So, hey, buddy, sound like to me you got to go back to the bottom because you just pulled this stunt saying this man cheating because you been watching the fight a million fucking times ever since the fight was over with. You watched a million you watched the fight a million times and you was kicking yourself in the ass and you was mad at yourself that you didn't walk away with the fight and you was bullshitting and you lost focus and you got caught with a left hook on the chin <laughs> and, and that was all she wrote. And you got hit with like triple uppercuts against the rope. And then the referee stopped it. So now you steady watching this fight over and over and over. Stop watching the fight, bro. That's what you gotta do, bro. Only time you should be watching the fight is if, if you trying to correct your mistakes that you made in a fight, not looking for something that Charlo did. You know what I'm saying? That's that's the problem, bro. You out here slandering. You just slandered this man, Brand, and he came out on top. You know what I'm saying? The devil, come on, man. The devil be working. And that what you niggas is. Little, little devils and demons running around right anymore. <laughs> Nigga. Come on, man. I'm finna post the shit on the screen with the California State Commission, man. They, they, they said that Charlo team asked them, can he use the Gatorade bottle? And they said, yeah, they allowed it. So you 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 steady talking? What is you saying, my nigga? I, I'm 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 telling you the facts. You can dislike my video. You can get them in the comment sessions and say I don't know what I'm talking about. You can call me a casual, whatever the fuck you fucking nerds like to do. You can do it, but I'm telling you straight facts, nigga. The 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 commission said they allow him to use the fucking Gatorade bottle since she squared out the water. Now, any further speculation is you just want to be Inspector Gadget guys, nigga. You want to be Inspector Gadget, and you want to be right. You want to be right. And you, and you ain't mad enough to come back and say I was wrong. You was wrong. You wrong. You wrong. You wrong. Tony Harrison wrong. And Tony Harrison ain't getting no motherfucking rematch since he want to be on some petty lame shit. You know what I'm saying? It's your name, man. It's your name, man. You can't be out here accusing dudes of cheating when when a nigga ain't cheating. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? When when you ain't got no evidence of a nigga cheating, you just say he cheating, man. You ain't you ain't getting that rematch, Tony Harris. You gotta fight from the bottom, my dude. Cause you, you I I just can't let this shit ride, man. Cause this motherfucker put the boxing world in a frenzy. He had everybody calling this man a cheat, man. I don't like that shit, man. That's why immediately when the shit came out, I made a video and I said, man, fuck that bottle. Keep talking about that bottle. I didn't see Canelo get pills slipped in his mouth at the weigh-ins and motherfucking all kind of shit. And he actually did get caught with clobuterol. And you niggas ain't never go this hard on him. That's how I know what it's about. I know y'all haters of Jamel Charlo. I'm not even the number one fan of Jamel Charlo. I fuck with him, though, and I fuck with Tony Harrison, too. But this was some sucker shit he did. And I'm just saying it like it is. Like, real talk. Like, I ain't the biggest fan, but I'm still a fan, though. I ain't the biggest fan of Jamel, but I'm still a fan, though. 
You know what I'm saying? This ain't what this about. A fan or no fan. Like, this is just real shit. I can't let niggas just slander the nigga name and brand when you wrong and you don't know what you talking about. But you want to be right so bad. You know what I'm saying? This you nigga problem, man. Do y'all do that in y'all relationships at home? Just let me know. Do y'all be at home and your bitch say the chicken got to be on the stove 30 minutes, but you say it got to be on for an hour? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Do you steady you go back and forth with her? Because if you do that, you ain't got no bitch. If you always like that. Now I know you a lonely fag who be in me there all, every day, all day. You know what I'm saying? These niggas crazy, man. I'm out, man. Peace.